A three-person rescue group calling themselves the Guardian Gals have been on the streets for two years in our area now. In fact, it's the subject of our pet rescue segment tonight. Action 10 John Ripolo has more on their hard work to save these dogs. Karen Turner spent the afternoon here at Animal Medical on Everhart with six puppies. Oh, and then they all want to come out. These pups will soon be transported to Canada to a rescue organization. So we were here to get their health certificates and make sure they're all okay for the trip. So but this is what Karen spends most of her time doing. Karen's rescue efforts begin here on the streets, rescuing dogs like this one. And take a look at this pup found on the streets, the before and after Karen's guardian gals group helped her survive. And Winnie and Wayne were picked up not far from Doctors Regional. Very malnourished, poor babies. They are currently being fostered thanks to this nonprofit. And this little chihuahua was also taken off the streets. Has it been rough? Karen is fostering her. She has rotten teeth and was picked up in Robstown roaming around on a leash. The stories of this group's efforts are incredible. If we get stuck in the, in the right. depressing, we won't be uh, inspired or motivated any longer. We need to focus on the positive. Each rescue is different, but the suffering of a helpless animal is the same. Watching dogs suffer and being so puzzled how so many people can walk by that animal and not do one thing to help. John Rapolo, Action 10 News. And John tells us if you'd like to donate money to the Guardian Gals, they are a nonprofit. You can go to their Facebook page, The Guardian Gals.